Alright, since there's a formula to calculate for concentration of a species in a solution, therefore, I already established that solubility is the concentration of solutes in a solution. Are you getting that? So, the solubility of a species has some various formulas. All of them are derived from the main formula. Yes. Solubility in mole per dm cube in mole per dm cube is just the same as this. So solubility of a solute in mole per dm cube is the number of moles of the solute times one thousand over volume, where numbers of moles can be mass over molar mass. So solubility is mass over molar mass. Which is already in gram per mole, we saw that earlier, times 1000 over volume in cm cube. Now, how about when the question asks you to calculate for the solubility in grams per dm cube? Very easy. You should note this that concentration in mole per dm cube just like moles is equal to concentration sorry concentration in gram per dm cube over molar mass over molar mass therefore mole per dm cube times molar mass is gram per dm cube so just take molar mass over there, you get gram per dm cube. So if I'm to convert this to gram per dm cube, I will just multiply it with molar mass. So molar mass cancel this molar mass. All right. Therefore, the solubility in solubility in gram per dm cube is just to remove molar mass from the formula. So it is going to be mass over one times 1,000 over volume. So with these two formulas, you can get answers on solubility. The next video will be when we solve with these formulas. But there are two bonus formulas we normally use over here in Nigeria to solve solubility of a solute in a solvent. I'm going to just give that immediately after now. Bonus formulas are going to be solubility. This works especially in water because the density of water is one gram per cm cube. It means for every cm cube of solution, there's one gram. For instance, if I'm to dissolve something in 50 cm cube of water, it means water is 50 gram. Why? Because the density of that water is one gram per cm cube. Meaning, in every gram of water, there's one cm cube. Or in every cm cube of water, there is one gram. That's the density of water. So especially in water, salts or solutes that dissolve in water, to calculate their solubility in more per dm cube, the first case, would be, would be, the solute, yeah, the mass of the solute over the mass of the solvent. This is a case when volume is not given up tense. And it's usually in water. There are some advanced questions that the density of the solvent will not be one gram. So you have to calculate the gram of the solvent. So we can work with solute, mass of solute over mass of solvent times 1000 over my molar mass molar mass is in gram per mole what about the same solubility how about the same solubility in grams per dm cube i told you is to just remove molar mass because gram per dm cube is equal to mole per dm cube times molar mass Molar mass, if it was existing, cancel molar mass. So it therefore means that in gram per cm cube, I have 
solute over solvent times 1000 over 1. You don't need molar mass in gram per dm cube. Thank you for watching the video. The next video will be on solubility too. Now in that video, I'm going to calculate and in subsequent videos, I'm going to also use the solubility curve and work on the constant of solubility and equilibrium, which is known as the KSP value. Goodbye.